Hi guys, and welcome back to High on Life. So, last time that we played through an episode of High on Life, we took out poor Dr. Giblets. Um, I don't know, he was one of my favorite bosses so far, just because he was so paranoid that it was funny. Well, after we took him out, we transported ourselves back and... Oh my gosh, what's this guy's name? Zerg? He wants to talk to us, so... Let's go ahead and jump back into it. Wow, look at that. You found Dr. Giblets all by yourself. See, it's not so easy figuring out where these bozos are. Let it go. Come on over, let's bow wow. Not lucky, this is RNG based. This is, it doesn't happen Gene, all the time. Gene, not, not Zerg. <laughs> you're seeing it, it's just you, lucky roll the dice. You popped up on your TV, now you're listening. Okay. At the end of it, if you're still there, you're uh, gonna get prizes. And now, the, the, count, the big countdown, and here we go. Is he we're eating our fucking cereal there? We're gonna count all the way down there? from 85. All right, and we're, we didn't start Sorry, yet, guys, so don't start counting weird. down yet. We're gonna, we're gonna start at 85 in a few seconds. All right, this is weird. I'm gonna restart from that checkpoint. <laughs> NG based. This is, it doesn't happen all the time. But if you're seeing it, it's just you, the lucky roll of the Okay, time. uh, so we did find Dr. Giblets. Um, he is dead, but we also found another Gatlian. Oh, shit. That's great. I, 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 I don't know about that. I mean, he, he's, he's not really functional. I, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't think he's dead, but. Oh, God damn. Yeah. He's busted up real bad. What were they doing to him? Oh, just. Do you, do you think he's salvageable? Buddy, I'm not gonna promise you I can save him. That would be irresponsible of me. You would be careless to toy with your emotions like that. But yes, I can definitely fix him. Okay, th <laughs> thanks, Gene. But you know, if, if he can't be saved, it, it wouldn't be, uh... What was that? Uh, nothing! I, 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 I was being shitty. You, you, you didn't hear me. You, I don't want you to hear me being shitty. Yeah, okay. Weird thing to say, but whatever. Sorry to change the subject, but, uh... Despite turning in, like, bounty DNA, I don't actually think that's useful because then you could be like, oh, take my blood, here you go, let's turn in this bounty, and the bounty is completely gone, I get the reward, he gets to stay alive. It's just not a good system, you know, but for the sake of this game, it's yeah. not a reality. I actually wanted to run something by you. How would you feel about me maybe fixing up my old bounty hunting ads, maybe putting you in them to drum up business? I mean... My name will still be bigger than yours in the logo, but we'd be stupid not to capitalize on your growing reputation. Yo, you guys are fresh out of Friendelos. Oh, hey, I I'm Tweeg. I'm dating your sister. Uh, this fucking guy. Tweeg, you need to leave. Um, Lizzie says it's cool if I'm here. You're just gonna let this sack of shit eat all my Friendelos and tongue kiss your sister? one who bought those fucking friendalos and leave Twig alone. You know he has a barbed tongue and he's very sensitive about it. I can go. No, Twig. You're staying. Tell him he's staying. Look, he doesn't even love you. He's <laughs> just after our house. It's our house. Exactly. Hey, Twig, you gotta be careful around Lizzie. She's just gonna hit it and quit it. <laughs> Real heartbreaker. I'd get out now while you're still in the green. And hey, you want a real lover? Talk to me. Don't you have a galaxy to fuck? Come on, tell him to leave. I don't feel like I should be getting involved in this. This isn't my problem. Thank you. I appreciate it. But honestly, it's my house too. So I don't even know why I have to fight for this. I'm just so pissed at everyone. I'm excited on Aww. your side almost Not like you, Twig. I love you, baby. Ah! Disgusting! Look at this! They're not even the same species! Do, do you know how many holes he has? And they're all really advanced level holes. You really gotta take my nephew instead. His holes are more your speed. Shut the hell up, Gene. I am sick of your shit. All you do is sit on our couch and mope about how sad your life is. You're a leech trying to eat all of our friendalos and use the only family I have left to relive your glory days. Hey! Your family's doing a great job. Mm -hmm. You know how hard it is to kill that many high-level bounties in such a short amount of time? I mean, it's not as fast as I could have done it, but, uh... I know they're doing a great job, and I'm proud of them. But I'm stuck here dealing with you all the time, and you're fucking pathetic. Tell him how pathetic he is. I don't want to get involved. 
Uh, he's working through some shit, dude. All right, come on. Don't make it sound so sad. Look, I admit I sad, wasn't dude. in a good you place when you lose. found me, but I feel like I'm part of and your family shitty. now. I'm basically Everywhere. your dad now. You too, Lizzie. I'm your dad. I'm just worried about you dating this weird freak who just wants to steal my couch away from me. Oh, boo-hoo. You can call it your couch when you start paying rent. Until then, no complaining about who lives here. Lives here? He's gonna live here? I mean, if you think we're ready, Tweeg. Oh, like, yeah, sure. Hey, shut up, Tweeg. This isn't about you. Why? Because you're worried you'll have to share a cushion? No! Because I... Because I'm concerned! You barely know this guy. That's and it's true. dangerous out there for humans. Oh, that's rich and condescending. I am not an idiot. I know what I'm doing. You're cool with Tweeg moving in, right? I am not. Hell yeah! That's the right call. Tweeg's a creep. You think I'm a creep? It's not because he's a creep. You are a creep. It's just because he's Everybody so better new. stop calling my boyfriend a creep. Effective immediately. You know, I just didn't realize I was a creep. Ugh, that's enough of this. Tweeg, let's go to the park. To, <laughs> to, to kiss? <laughs> yeah. Anybody got a fucking problem with that? Eesh. Sorry I said anything. Let's just get back to the bounty hunting. Yeah, let's get past Can't wait to show you those new commercials. Hey, bounty hunter! Hey, uh, if you're playing this game, congratulations! You sit and watch this commercial, you're gonna get prizes! If you watch this whole commercial, um, you got lucky. This is RNG based. This is it doesn't happen all the time. Mm -hmm. uh, if you're seeing it, it's just you, lucky roll of the dice. Popped up on your TV. Now you're listening. At the end of it, if you're still there, you're gonna get prizes. And now the count. You make a better door than a window, kid. We're gonna count all the way down from 85. All right, and we didn't start yet, so don't start counting down yet. We're gonna we're gonna start at 85 in a few seconds. Those seconds do not count as part of the countdown. All right, here we go. You ready? Just getting prepped to do all the numbers. Here we go. 85. That was the start. That was the first number. Okay. Just making, just being clear. Don't want you to get confused. I'm moving on. That's the second all right. I'm going to go over to Jorbs real quick. 83. And uh, buy some shit. Oh. oh. Come on. I hated w looking at these things when I was growing up. I don't need to look at them now. Come on. How are you supposed to get your name out there? Hey, Open over here! Eyes, Widow asshole. with the talking gun! I'm the little concession man! I got a legal thing I know what the illegal thing you Come over here. You can buy pitch a me and I don't want it. What's that guy yelling about? Illegal stuff? Is he talking to us? Nope. No, he's come not. Come in! Come in! Loot box. What are you? Durahill. That's right. Enjoy! Ceiling light. What are those little kid shoes? I don't know why I need a bicycle. Oh, these are upgrades for the guns. Okay, where's the one for Gus? Because Gus is my favorite by far. Gus, reload tracked. And an ammo sack. I don't like the names of these things. Portaling your item to the baggage area now. Oh, oh it's the passes. big G3 killer. You think I'm supposed to be impressed? Well, wait till you kill a G4 and maybe I'll talk to you. Uh, Wed's my shift over. I need to go to finally. This, cat, this guy, his dad is literally employing him for slave labor. Excuse like child labor. me. That's, uh, that's a. Doing a power slide. Look at you. Damn right I am. I only got 500 pesos left, but my boy Gus. I'm pretty sure Tweeg is against us, like he's going to smoke um, the sister, but I am... Um, it could be wrong. Alright, Scrindle Brothers. Back over to Zephyr Paradise. Colorful player. A moblet! Uh, what's going on, pal? It's you, the savior! You know it, bud! Where's the rest of your crew? Oh, uh, it was awful. Everyone else got enslaved again, if you can believe it. Honestly, I think they like being enslaved. No, 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 hey, no judgment here. Everyone's got their kink. Where can we find them? 
They're working at Screndo Labs now, just past the Mushroom Valley here. Just be careful. That place is freaky. Hey, we appreciate it, bud. Gus is the best gun in this goddamn game. And I will fight people. Let's say he is. All right. <laughs> Show off those killer jetpack skills, bud. <laughs> Whoa! Now we're talking. Love Hell that yeah. jungle breeze on my face. I can't wait to get back on the ground. <laughs> now this feels like the right way. Trust me, I can just feel it on my skin. But you're like a frog. Get you right. Oh, that's right. Run away, Crowley Hunter. Bye bye. Alright, sweetie. Oh, yeah? You wanna fucking die? Okay, then. B3 is lost sight of the bounty hunter. <laughs> Ooh, I'm so down the clown, man. Oh no, that's absolutely delicious. You know, things are going pretty well with me and Tweak. I know it's probably weird for you, but that your sister is dating an alien, but I need you to get over it. You and me, we got this! It's weird enough for me that I'm dating an alien. I can't have you freaking out about it, too. I'm not freaking out about shit, girl. I am fine. Jetpack! What the fuck are you trying to support, bitch? Do I just literally. Oh, Alright, hey. I killed three people. It's just me clicking. Okay. Just one sec. Hey, we don't have to wait for this guy. Let's just open the door on our own.
Oh, press that one up. I press space bar. We haven't gone back to that. Can we use yet. that zip line to cross? Uh, sure. And so, uh, you know, what, what do you think Scrandle Labs is like? I mean, I, I, mean, like, I, I know a little bit. I mean, I, I, I heard a bit. So, so I kind of know. But I, I'm just making small talk right now. You know, I'm just trying to, I'm just trying to fill the dead air. It's really uncomfortable. I mean, don't get mad at me if what I'm saying isn't that interesting because you know I'm, I'm doing my best here. You know. You're right. It isn't very interesting. So I'm just gonna not worry about it. Anybody getting some, uh... If these elevators were working, we could just ride them all the way up! Halo Infinite, uh, vibes from that. Hello, and welcome to Scranda Labs. Oh, oh, you're the bounty hunter who stepped up and took charge in the office and killed my boss, Krubus. Very unorthodox leadership style, but you got results. You're damn right anyway, I did. sorry, I need to let the G3 know you're here. Just my job, nothing personal. Feel free to have some candy. You're, you're gonna, gonna set off the alarm. Yep, I'm gonna set off the alarm. We've got an intruder. G3 are coming for you. Sorry, it's my job. And I don't care about you. G3 coming our way, but those elevators are calling our names. I gotta say, it felt good to kill that guy. Alright. Well, I guess they keep setting off the alarm that made things easy. Just a little reminder, I got some sick ass this. How is this elevator practical? I don't get it. Somebody tell me why they would build an elevator like this. What are they gonna do next? Add spikes? Hell yeah! You do a lot of shootouts on elevators? Because you're good at it. Look at you! I'm impressed! What's that? Fuck my dick! Ah, look at us! We got to the top! Get the intruders! Don't let them find the test subject! Oh, come on, we're just popping our heads in. We can't put them in the way! They don't leak into the test subject, fuck! They want another taste! Ridiculous. Got him. Oh, good work clearing them out. Now let's poke around and see what kind of weird experiments they're doing in here. Are they trying to mix a Fergal with a human? This is our best human Fergal hybrid specimen. It may not be as cool as our subject in the weapons lab, but it's still rather beautiful, isn't it? We call it a fur man. Or maybe a hurdle. I we haven't decided yet. Why am I telling you all this? You know, to be honest, it's because you look cool and a little bit badass, to be frank. This is a dead human with a burgle on top. I like a toupee. Who's the scientist here? Me or you, huh? 
Why do you want to kill them so bad? I'm not doing it. All right, maybe he's not the best. Oh, what we get? Oh, what a fucking mess in here. Now, this is exactly what I was expecting. Hello, Jonathan. It's Dr. Gurgula. I've been asked to send you some of my findings on the human genome. It's only a small portion, and I doubt you'll even be able to comprehend what you're looking at. But I promised Garmantua as I'd provide them. And now, please don't contact me again. I'm busy. Am I the only one getting bad vibes? From the Dr. Gurglia guy? Is it just me? What is Gurglia? Is it what you, the, the sound that you make when you're using mouthwash? Huh? <laughs> Am I the only one with fresh breath? You might be, but I think this is a good place to stop for this episode. So, the Skindle brothers, did they take over Dr. Giblet's lab after I took him out? Or are they just both working as like partners to one another? I don't know, but Dr. Gurglia doesn't seem friendly to us, but that's fine. We'll take care of him when the time comes. But for now, hope you guys had a good time and enjoyed this episode of High on Life. And I will talk to you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.